Hello, bees bladers. Welcome back and welcome newcomers to the channel. I have a bunch of sweet EDC gear to show you guys and gals. We're gonna go through it all really quick. Hang out because I've got some limited edition stuff to show you, brand new releases, and we're gonna go through them really quick. This is all the new stuff from the Olight sale. You know, they have one every month. This is for May 2023, and this is the Roboto 2. Would you look at it? Just look at it. And you know, I'm not an O fan of every O knife that's released, but this one, I'm telling you right now, spoiler alert, I love it. I mean, I absolutely love it. It has a deep carry pocket clip, flat screws, it's reversible, this is 100% ambidextrous, and you could, you could put a lanyard in it, plus it has the stars and stripes, and if you're not a fan of the stars and stripes on your knife, they also have the carbon fiber version. It's the carbon fiber overlay, but this knife, oh yeah, look at that. Look at that blade. Oh <laughs> yeah, I love, absolutely love this blade shape. It is so useful. It's one of my favorites, the modified Warney Cliff Sheep's Footy Blade. But with this particular one, it's not just the blade that I like, it's the action. It reminds me so much of the Kaiser Drop Bear and the way that it is that smooth. So if you have a Drop Bear or if you've seen any of my reviews on the Drop Bear, this is the kind of action you're getting with this knife. It is that smooth. I mean, when you're pointing down and you just pull it back, it sucks the blade back into the handle just like that. And you can reverse flick it. It has very good traction on the thumb studs. The action is just, I mean, it is liquid. It is just totally liquid. When they put out a knife that's this good with this quality, it, it always goes fast. I mean, what could I say? It has ceramic ball bearings in the pivot. It has a very nice finish. The finish on Olight's knives is always really, really nice. And this is that aluminum that they use. It does have liners. It's milled out. It is not a heavy knife. And I don't have to go overboard to tell you how much I like it. Now, it does need a sharpening tool, but look at here, the plunge grind goes straight down, which is a plus when it comes to sharpening. The jimping leaves me wanting a little bit more. It's good jimping, but it's not quite aggressive, as aggressive as I prefer. It does a good job. I just wish it was just a little more. Now, you know that I have a large width hand. It fits my hand just right. Now, if you have an extra large hand, it might be a tad small for you. Now, because it doesn't have a flipper, oh, and by the way, when you walk through doorways, don't just fling your arms around like an ape because <laughs> you might you might catch it on the door jam, and door jams are tougher than skin. Last time I checked, anyway, Oh, and I forgot to tell you, this one comes with the challenge coin, which I haven't even seen yet. Let's get this out of here very carefully. Oh, okay, so this one has a different finish. Check it out. Roboto 2. <laughs> that is pretty sweet. Knife folding, what does that say? Oh, knife folding pocket knife. I can't read anymore. That is very nice. I like the I like the finish on it. I like the feel of it. You could do a heads or tails with that bad boy. But back to the knife just real quick. From tip to tip, it's 7.2 inches long. It has a 2.9 inch cutting length. So you're under the three inch mark. Everybody that has rules where you can't have a three inch blade, you're good to go for that. It only weighs 3.85 ounces. It feels fantastic. The action is fantastic. The grip and the ergos are fantastic. I don't really have many nitpicks other than what I've already told you. This is a fantastic knife. And these run, uh, what are they, uh, $84.99 during the sale. If you're familiar with Olight, you know they always give a freebie. And right now, if you're watching this, the VIP access is already going on. And the public access starts on May 16th at 8 p.m. Eastern time and goes through May 18th. If you're gonna go check them out, use the link in the description or the comments of this video, and it'll help support Bee's Blades. And I know there's new people on every video that have it, hasn't seen all of the things I've shown. This is the Gober Safety Light. These normally run about like $14, $15. You can have it flashing different colors. You can change the colors of it. You can have it flashing red. It goes very well on your dog's collar. You can have it flashing, but you see right here, it has a clip right there that keeps it on whatever you clip it to. So you can have one on your back, you can have one on the dog's collar, one on the stroller, you name it. So if you're walking at night or if you're camping or hiking or anything, or if you wanna have the, give the kids something fun so you can keep track of the kids, these are pretty cool. All you have to do is log on to Olight and you get one of these bad boys free, or you can buy one for like 15 bucks. And as always, Olight always has, they always have deals and packages. And with this for a dollar more, you get one of these patch, one of these pouches. And I'll show you these Olight brand new O pouches here in just a second. 
Now I've shown this before. This is the Open Pro that has the light, the very light, bright light on the side and the laser pointer, but hold up, hold up. They've totally, totally done a 360 or a 180 or one of those numbers. It's the Open Glow. This bad boy has a sweet feature or two I'm getting ready to show you. These are a limited edition. You could get them in OD green, black, blue, or you can also get these in the stars and stripes. It has a light right here on the clip. It goes from five to 120 lumens. And I'm telling you right, if you, sh if you shine that on a piece of paper, you're gonna have spots in your eyes. It is super bright. Now check this out. Here's the thing that's really cool about this one. When you have the pin untracted, <laughs> When you have the pin out, if you give it one click, it actually has a light so you could write in the dark if you want to. It is pretty sweet. If you want to be a little incognito while you're writing and that's the only light you have, that is pretty cool. But while you're writing, if you hold down on the, on the tail switch, then you get the side light, which is extremely bright. And to use the light on the tail switch, all you got to do is hold down and you can go up through the different brightness levels while your light is still on, but you can turn it back off. Now, when you close the light, if you want to do some pointing, all you do is push upwards on the bolt and then you have the laser light, which your cat will love, your dog will love, or if you're actually pointing to something across the room. Now, there's one other thing that is so cool about this that I'm going to show you in just a second, but when you're, when you're not using the pin, you could just click it and turn the light on and then just hold it down to go up through the modes, it's that easy. And then you just click it to turn it back off. But look at this, it's rechargeable. And to recharge it, you do not have to, with past ones, you, you would uh, have to unscrew them to plug them in. You don't. On your desk, you can have this, which is USB-C. You can have it go into your charger, have this on your desk, and all you do, <laughs> you can't see, all you do is set it in here and that's how it charges. Is that not the coolest thing ever. You can see there's metal contacts in there and then there's metal contacts in here. And you know what? A shout out to my wife, Mrs. Bees. When I showed her the feature of this light and I turned, I, tur <laughs> I turned the light on, I clicked it and she said, oh, it's like a Harry Potter. And I was like, oh my gosh. So if you're a Harry Potter fan, you can, Expialidocious or whatever it is. Okay, yes. So I'm having fun, but that I like to do that. I like to have a lot of fun. But this, uh, <laughs> I am having too much fun. But you can see that there's contacts right there, and that's how it charges. So I think that is a very, very cool feature. Of course, you got to put the pin in while it's charging. But this is very magnetic, so you can stick this to a metal whatever. And if whatever you have isn't metal, you can use this. It comes with this little magnetic plate and a couple extra 3M strips so you can stick this to whatever you want and then you can have a place to keep your pin charged all the time. So you always have a bright flashlight in your pin. While they're having their May sale, these are running like $55, $56. But of course they always have the bundle. And look at this, we got the Stars and Stripes i3T, baby. This you can get for $6 if you get this with the bundle. And if you're not familiar with the i3T, this is a classic. It takes a AAA battery or a rechargeable AAA. This is the one of most one of the most simple and probably one of the most carried EDC flashlights you're ever going to see. It has the double helix going on, gives you great grip so you're not going to drop it. And of course, this is going with the Stars and Stripes theme. It has the two-way pocket clip. You can put it on your hat. You can go out and look for worms. And it's just, it's simple. It's five lumens and 180, 180 lumens. One click is five Give it another click and it's 180. I mean, this is not doing it justice how bright this flashlight is. You do not have to completely click it. You could just hold it down. If you just need a light for a minute, you can just hold it down and let go and it turns off. And it is very tactile. It's very clicky, very easy to use, lightweight. It'll go in your EDC pouch. I'll show you what it looks like in the new Olight O pouch here in just a second. But for all you newbies that haven't seen the Olight products and the Olight knives and all that stuff, they are made very well. They have a great fit, a great finish. I don't have any complaints whatsoever. I love the lights. Now these run like 18, 18 or $19 if you're not getting it with a bundle with something else and then it ends up being like five or six bucks. And while we're showing the stars and stripes, yep, here you go, the O-Tackle. 
If you've seen the O tackle before, you know all about it. There's not a lot that I have to tell you. This right here is a lion face. It's also, you can see right there, it has a tooth. It is also a, a bottle open, bottle cap opener. And then you have a little pry over here. You can use that if you're opening up the top of a can. And then this is a quarter inch hex head right there. And look at this. Got a little bees comb going on over here. And the first time that, that I saw this was in my last Olight video. I believe it was the last one. That was a major improvement. Because before that, you had to use a screwdriver. Now, you can not only lock it so it won't open in your pocket or in, in, your, in your pouch or anything like that. You can, all you have to do is unscrew this by hand. And you can put a fresh blade in. Or you can turn the blade around to a fresh side. So it has two stops, you have one right here, and if you look at the cutting path, this is great to use if you're opening packages or something and you don't wanna cut what's inside, so you don't have a lot of blade showing. Or if you wanna really get out there and swing, it's very comfortable in your hand, it has good grip, it has really good texture on it. Uh, oh yeah, look at that. A Little bit of texture vision for you. So it's stars and stripes. I think it's pretty cool. I really like the O-Tackle and I have a couple of them and I have one hanging at work. I have one in my pouch and this also goes in your fifth pocket. Very nice. If you're you're out drinking some soda with your friends and this right here would really come in handy if you're, you're opening a lot of bottles. And you'd be surprised at how many uses you get out of this little bitty, I mean, you, I've used them as a screwdriver, I've used them to scrape stuff. This is actually very handy when you don't wanna rip your nails back and forth. But they actually have, these must be pretty popular. They have a limit of six on these and they run about $14, $15. Something else, I'll call it an honorable mention. You've seen me talk about the Artfeld and I'm just letting you know they have two new versions of the Artfeld available. One of them is the Spring 3 and the other is the Eternal, and they look very shagadelic. But these are very great, lightweight, EDC, very bright. I believe they're like a thousand lumens. But I just wanted to give that a little mention because I noticed that when I was perusing the Olight website. And another honorable mention is, <laughs> oh yeah, just because, like I said, I was checking out the website, seeing what was on sale. The Marauder Mini is on sale, y'all. This is 7,000 lumens of spotlight or flood power. <laughs> I mean, I'm not going to do a whole deal on it, but I got to tell you, this is one of my absolute favorite flashlights. It has red, green, and blue that you can use. The spot on this thing, uh, by the way, to turn it on, it has a safety. You turn the wheel, and then not only can you see what your charge is at the moment, you have to turn the wheel, which is a safety, then you can turn on the light. And If you're seeing this right here, that's on low, and that's on the spot. Right here's a switch and you could go to flood and it literally will light up my entire backyard. This is as low as it goes. So uh, if you've been wanting one of these, uh, you know, everyone tends to wait. You look, you can change the colors by holding it down, red, green, blue, and they're very bright. You can light up the night sky. And, and I think it says somewhere on here, uh, yeah, right there, 7,000 lumens at six football fields. But if you've been waiting for one of these to go on sale, just letting you know the Murata Mini's on sale. I can't help it. I love all these gadgets and gear. This is the O Pouch A1 and the O Pouch A1 Mini. Check it out. If you like a pouch to keep your stuff in, in your pocket, I went ahead and put the new stuff in here. Here is the IT3, and then here is the new. Oh, yeah, there you go. Look at that. So you can see that it fits a full size pocket knife, and you can put something else in here. And check it out. It has a Velcro feel, or a what do you call it? Hook and loop, to be uh, correct. And it comes with an Olight patch, and you could you could put a bunch of patches on here. You can see that I have a an arc felt in on this side, and on this one, these only run like uh, what 14 14 to be exact during the sale 14 dollars and 44 cents there's room to put stuff in here you can see i have an o tackle and then i also have look at that this looks just like the mini marauder <laughs> look familiar how about that? You could have that bad boy. That's another multi-tool. I don't even know if they have this one on sale or not, but I was just grabbing stuff to show you what all you could fit in there. You could put money or whatever in this zipper pocket. They're YKK zippers, which are very good. They're like the top of the line. They don't get caught. The pockets on these, they're thickened with the extra stitching. It prevents tearing and breaking and all that stuff. Now, I have no idea what this is, but they're made of 900D polyester with high elastic PV. PVC Oxford cloth. I have no idea what that is, but it's supposed to resist spills and stuff like that. There's a little bit of texture vision for you. It does have that nice um, kind of canvasy feel, but it is still bendy. So it's not gonna be too stiff in your pocket. 
But these are pretty cool and they come with different bundles for different prices. I mean, I couldn't possibly tell you all the stuff that they have for sale, but here is the mini. The mini doesn't have the zipper pocket, but you can put a, a mini O-pin in there. And I do have, here's the Roboto 3 that fits in there, no problem. And this one also comes with the little pouch and this whole edge right here, this whole side is the, the hook and loop field. So these are pretty cool. These, these right here, oh, and by the way, Here's the other O-Tackle. This is the carbon fiber one. Don't know if it's on sale. Just wanted to stick something in there to show you all of the gear. And oh yeah, there's another i3T that I stuck in there just to show you. You know me, I love gadgets. I love gear. I love knives. If you love any of that stuff and you haven't subscribed to Bees Blades, definitely subscribe because every Friday night, Bees Blades live at the hive. Oh, right. We have a lot of fun. But if you want to go check out any of this stuff or any of the bundles or all that good stuff, make sure you use my link. It helps support the channel. Doesn't cost you anything, but go watch this video. You're really going to like that. And until I see you again in the chats or in the comments of this video, telling me what you like the best or at the hive stream, remember live life in the present, keep a band aid handy and don't cut yourself.